Yo, what is good, everyone? In this video, I'm going to share a concept that will eventually become an essential tactic of the best players in Season of Discovery, and that is rune swapping. This idea will let you have access to all of your rune spells at any given time by enabling you to instantly change your entire rune setup the second you drop combat. Now, there are going to be an almost unlimited number of situations where this will be useful, but let's imagine a couple to get us started. Say you're playing a mage leveling up, farming, or in a dungeon. While you're killing one mob at a time or fighting a boss, you have Arcane Blast on your gloves because it absolutely murders single target. As soon as you're about to do a big AoE pull or right before your tank is about to pull a big pack, you instantly swap your Arcane Blast gloves for Firebomb gloves with this macro. Now you can maximize your AoE damage on the big group and as soon as the fight is over and combat drops, you can instantly switch right back to Arcane Blast again. Now let's consider a PvP scenario where this concept will be even more useful. Imagine you're a mage dueling a rogue. To start off, you take regeneration on your chest and rewind time on your gloves. The rogue opens on you and you use rewind time and regen to survive their burst until you can secure a sheep. Then you heal to full and as soon as combat drops, you press a single keybind which instantly changes your glove rune to ice lance, your chest to fingers of frost, and your legs to icy veins while you top off your mana. Now you get to open on the rogue from max health with a full frost setup even though you just used two healing runes to survive their open. Additionally, the rogue has no idea what new spells you just swapped to, or if you even swapped at all. This, my friends, is the power of rune swapping. From the rogue's perspective, you can utilize this same exact idea off of a sap or while in stealth. So here's how it works. Basically, for any slot you want to rune swap, you'll need to find multiple pieces of gear and put the runes permanently on those pieces. For good players really trying to min max, this is actually another advantage because you can look for gear with stats that align with that specific rune. As an easy example, say you found some gloves with fire spell power. Those would be perfect to be your designated living bomb gloves, but you'd never want to use them with arcane blaster ice lance. As a more general example, on mage you might normally be prioritizing spell power and intellect on your pants for most of your runes, but for your mass regeneration rune you might want to prioritize healing power instead, and for your arcane surge rune you might want to stack as much spirit as possible to really maximize that 300% mana regen window. So you could have three different kinds of pants. Intellect Spell Power Pants for your Living Flame and Icy Veins, Healing Power Pants for your Mass Regen, and Spirit Pants for your Arcane Surge. Now your runes with the appropriate stats aligned are permanently slotted on those items and you can instantly swap the items out of combat with this macro. You can utilize this idea for individual runes or for sets of runes. If you want to have full control and be able to instantly swap between any rune combo at any given time, you can set up a macro for each individual rune and bind them each to a key maybe to your function keys or to your numpad. With this setup, if you knew your binds well, you could swap to the exact combo of runes you needed even if you only had a split second out of combat. If you have a class or build where several runes work together synergistically, it might make more sense to create sets of runes for those combos where pressing a single button will switch the entire set. So for an easy example on Mage, maybe you have four sets bound to four different keybinds that instantly switch between your arcane healing runes, your arcane damage runes, your fire runes, and your frost runes. To set this up, all you have to do is create this very simple macro that I've been showing, and that is slash equip slot with the associated number of the slot you are trying to equip, and then the exact name of the item following it. If you want to create a set, you simply add the same line multiple times for the different slots. I always like to add hashtag show tooltip at the beginning so that if I mouse over it on my keybinds, it will show me the item and the associated rune. Then add this macro button to your action bars where you can bind it to a keystroke or somewhere you can click it very quickly once you drop combat. Now think about this. This idea is powerful right now with three rune slots available and four to five runes available in each slot. Imagine how powerful it will become as the game continues to scale with more rune slots becoming available and more spells becoming available in each slot. Not only will this create another very exciting and deep mechanic that can be utilized with the other mechanics introduced in Season Discovery, but also utilizing this concept effectively will allow players to implement it to absolutely dominate by having access to their full rune spell arsenal at any given time. Boom, that's all I got for this one. Uh, I hope you found it valuable. Uh, make sure to stay tuned for Weapon Swap Macros next, followed by a reworked Mage Healing Guide and a bunch of new Mage Build videos that I'll be working on over the next couple weeks. If you want to hang out in Theorycraft with me, uh, you can find me live on Twitch. Most of the time I am playing at Zikrik with a zero. Um, and besides that, I uh, really appreciate you watching. Make sure to take care of yourself, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.